Kate Middleton was stung by Queen Elizabeth II's criticism of her frivolous displays of wealth, a royal author claims. Kate Middleton and Prince William are now happily married and have welcomed their beautiful children Prince George, Princess Charlotte and Prince Louis into the royal family. However, before the royal couple's engagement, the Queen had words of criticism about the future Duchess of Cambridge. The Queen's criticism came amid her grave concerns about Kate not having a full-time job, two years before the royal engagement was announced. Ms. Nicol, in her 2010 book William and Harry, delves into the earlier days of the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge's relationship. She explains, if, Kate, was not with William at Balmoral then the couple were skiing or holidaying on Mystique. Kate was there so often the press dubbed her Queen of Mystique a title that had previously belonged to Princess Margaret. The Queen's sister Princess Margaret was well known for her love of the Caribbean island, where she would escape from royal life and host infamous parties. Ms. Nicol continues, Britain was now in recession and such frivolous displays of wealth were unpalatable to the Queen. She is one of the hardest working royals, despite her age, and that a future member of the family was without a full-time job was unacceptable to her. She writes that Kate was hurt, claiming, she was stung by the Queen's criticism. Although Clarence House advised her not to react to press interest in the Queen's concerns, Kate did reveal that she was working for her parents' company party pieces. Ms. Nichols explains, later on, a black and white photograph of Kate was posted on the company website. But it was deemed a step too far and within weeks it had been removed from the website. She also says that the Queen intervened in getting Kate started in charity work. She writes, the Queen had quietly suggested that Kate affiliate herself with the charity and, by September, she was involved with Starlight, which works with seriously and terminally ill children.